Hi, I'm Erica Rivas, and welcome to the 2024 Pasadena Showcase Hall. house is at the Potter Daniels Manor on the Arroyo Seco looking over the Rose Bowl. It was the home of the 1975 Pasadena Showcase House, 1996 and this year 2024. Come along with me for a tour. <laughs> Nestled among the verdant embrace of the Arroyo Seco in Pasadena, Potter Daniels Manor stands as a magnificent testament to timeless elegance and historical significance with a designation as a Pasadena city landmark. This exquisite estate bears witness to a bygone era of opulence and refinement and offers views of the historic Colorado Street Bridge and the Rose Bowl, both which didn't exist at the time that this home was constructed. Originally, this house was built in 1902 as a graceful shingle style structure by Joseph J. Blick for the Daniels family. In 1922, the home was magnificently transformed into an English Tudor Revival estate. Embracing the fairy tale essence of the 120 year old English Tudor estate, inspiration for the foyer came from the beautiful walnut woodwork, elaborate ceiling mural, and gorgeous stained glass window. The formal living room has been meticulously crafted to exude elegance, charm, and approachability. It beckons guests to linger, drawn by the allure of the original carved marble fireplace, stunning views, and a cozy ambiance adorned with luxurious fabrics. The dining room transcends the ordinary with the 25,000 year old Maori tree table, the hand painted ceiling mural, luxurious upholstery and silver parquet flooring. It would be an understatement to say the dining room is over the top. That's crazy! That's so cute. Look at those. That's amazing. Yeah. You want to hold it? Yeah, I did. Let's see. Let's see. How cool that is. Made in Italy. Wow. From the dining room, step into the captivating veranda that was designed by Stephen Cordray. Everything in the room was designed by me. All the carpet, the floors, and the drapes, and the walls are all in the room. All scrubbable, washable food. Thank you. I made all the gardening over your head by hand. Okay, I'm just <laughs> 
with the sweets. All the sweets. I love it. This is so gorgeous. It really is. Gorgeous. I like the peacock. I know. Oh, look at how beautiful you look. Original warm wood paneling and quiet luxury set the scene for the library lounge and curiosity room. Unplug and unwind, this space encourages relaxation and curiosity free from the interruptions of modern technology. Underneath the staircase of the foyer is a powder room with an enchanting floral wallpaper and modern furnishings. Welcome to the Primary Bedroom Suite, a modern interpretation of the timeless English country estate aesthetic where sophistication meets charm in perfect harmony. The primary bathroom is cohesive as a bedroom suite with light blue and neutral wallpaper. Get in the bathtub, Lisa. Let's test it out. The Media Oasis is a headlining environment that is sure to receive an encore from tech lovers. And call it Juniper. Because yeah. to me yeah. it looks like a Juniper. Yeah. Yeah. I love it. Pretty. Is this headboard? Is that teak? We're good with me. Um, it is a Ipe teak blend. It's a okay. doorway from India and it's 18th century. Wow. Blend. So it's an Indian artifact. I took That's the cool. French doors off and then I custom made the mirrors and installed the mirrors for the head. Amazing. 1,100 pounds. It took eight of us to get it up No kidding. One piece? I don't know. I'm hoping she'll keep it. Hi. The Romantic Chambers is a bedroom and bathroom suite designed by Carmine Sabatella, a colleague within my brokerage who also owns a design firm. This suite exudes a stately elegance reminiscent of the Great Gatsby era. A monochromatic canvas of deep emerald green envelopes the space from the walls and ceiling to the bedding and bathroom tiles. The magical royal nursery is where fairy tales meet elegance with soft pastels, silvery neutrals, and gilded accents. A regal crib draped in cascading fabrics is surrounded by plush, velvet, and rugs. The designer Mark Hermogino reimagined the butler's pantry, kitchen, family room, powder room, and mudroom to reflect timeless elegance and sophistication. The countertops are a classic Calcutta quartz with a waterfall edge on both sides of the stove. The cabinetry is painted a color called Skipping Stones, which is the Dun and Edwards color of the year and is seen in various rooms of the house.
Off the kitchen, you step out onto the outdoor kitchen and patio. I love this. Where's my margarita? <laughs> oh my god, look at that grill. I've never seen anything like that. It's new by Fire Magic. Jeez. The Arroyo Vista Garden invites visitors with breathtaking views of the Arroyo Seco and the Colorado Street Bridge from a terrace. And just around the corner on the south side of the house is the Culinary Garden and Conservatory. Thanks for joining me along today on a tour of the 2024 Showcase House. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Viva Rivas. The Pasadena Showcase House for the Arts dates back to 1965 with 7,500 people attending that first year. Proceeds from the Showcase House along with donations they receive make funding three annual music programs possible. What's more, they award gifts and grants to other nonprofit organizations that provide music programs to children in Southern California.